Hi guys, back for another quick vid. Uh, so finally taking the 35 out today and we're going to start the 55cc up and uh, take it for a run as well. So first off I've got to do is put the, first off I've got to put some fuel in it and uh, I've never used this WJ71 carb before so um, I've had a look up online how to use this carb. Also watched uh, Mike um, Taylor doing it on YouTube so I'll just follow those steps and see what happens Okay, got a 25 to 1 mix Let's put this in here They have no idea what to expect. Like I said, this is my first big ball engine. So I have no idea what's gonna happen. All right, turn the remote on. Okay, like I said, I've got no idea what to expect. Throttle's on, kill switch is on. So, what I've read is you've got to idle this for about five minutes with giving it small revs and then uh, shut it down let it cool down and then just go for it so first off I'll get some fuel through the line so I'll just give it a bit of a push that so put the choke on chokes on like I said I've got no idea what to expect here Let's give it a first pull there was the noise pop the choke back and this little black thing pop back so I have no idea what to happen here Probably no fuel in the line yet. Nah. What we'll do is I'll choke it again. Until I hear a pop. There we go. That's what I wanted to hear. Choke off. Pull that black one off. Hopefully, she'll start. All right, I was expecting that. Let's start it back up again. Okay, this time we'll give it a bit of a rev. Okay, not getting nothing. Put the tank back on. Till you hear a pop. That's what you want here. Give it a bit of a throw. Just a little bit.
Okay, I'll turn the throttle down a bit. Yeah, she's a whole turn like a kitten. Turn it off, let it cool down, then we'll uh, take it out. And uh, maybe while this is cooling down, I'll take the 35 out. I don't know, see, see what happens. But uh, yeah, so with the WJ71 carp, you um, put the choke on, push it down towards you, which will lock this plastic piece in, and just pull it over till you get that pop. And uh, then you pull the choke off, pull that black piece off, and then uh, just pull it, she'll fire. And uh, so I, my idle is a bit too high, so I've turned it down now, so it sounds much, much better. But I'll let it cool down and I'll take the 35 out, I guess. Might as well do that now. Okay, I took the 35 out the other day. I worked out what the problem was, what was happening with the vibration, the connection that goes to the battery was coming loose so it was just shutting it down so that's all that was wrong with it so anyway let's take this out and see what see what happens Oh, that's the 35 in action. Absolutely flies. Uh, it just needs more of a tune. But other than that, absolutely awesome. So, all right, 55's cooled down. Let's take that out now.
Hmm. Now well, that's its uh, first run. Uh, obviously it's not tuned, but bloody hell. And uh, have a bit of a play around with it. But uh, that's its first run, guys. Um, we've got a lot to do to it, but uh, I was talking to, uh, was it Nitro Freak? On YouTube. Now he's put the um, Rooster Tail carb on his. And he sounds really, really crisp. This double J71 carb, um, I don't know too much about yet. I'll keep trying it, see what happens with it. But uh, if I can't get it to work, then I'll probably put a rooster tail carb on it. Yeah, so towards the end there, I didn't think I had any throttle. Yeah, the linkage actually came off. I'll just put it back on. But that, that whole red piece come off, so obviously didn't screw it up for, far enough. But uh, it was running really rich. That's why it wasn't... Uh, that's why it was sounding the way it was um, But uh, after a couple of tanks I can tune it and uh, Go from there. Sh should be uh, perfect So I might take the 35 back out. I don't know yet um, It needs to be tuned but uh, There are thrust washes you can buy for this 35 cc motor uh, Taylor RC sells them um, I recommend you guys get the thrust washers and install them into your uh, 35 uh, they're just a bit more reliable that's all anyway guys um yeah hope you enjoyed this video and i'll catch you on the next one all right see you bye